there are no data yet on whether the vaccine prevents transmission. Um, so you could be vaccinated. You might get asymptomatic disease rather than symptomatic disease, not know that you're infected, but still be able to transmit to others. So what the vaccine does, is it sort of downgrades the clinical level of infection you get, but it may not stop you from infecting your nearest and dearest. So without those data, it's hard to, to uh, use a sort of, um, what you might call a ring vaccination is not quite the right term for it, but to sort of vaccinate the the, the contacts of somebody who's at risk. Um, uh, and the protection you get from the vaccine is so it's actually m- much better than we were really expecting. And even in somebody who's immunosuppressed to a degree, there should be a reasonable level of protection. And that is likely to prevent them from getting serious infection. I mean, there are some people who are really immunosuppressed where it's a bit more difficult, but actually most people, even with blood cancer, their their immune system is competent enough to induce a, a response to the vaccine that will be protective, we believe.